Alright guys, so back with another video here. This is probably the 11th time I've shot this due to Xiaomi's bootloader unlocking policy. You gotta wait 14 days to count down the exact hours. It is now, I think it's, time is it? It is now 3.38 Eastern. It said yesterday I had 25 hours around, give or take. Hopefully, we're good enough to go and this is the last time I'm going to shoot this really crazy video it's getting to be annoying <laughs> i should be doing this via a screen record but i guess you can see basically good enough like that all right so the first thing you're going to do you're going to need the phone obviously um you're going to need this me flash unlock tool which i will put down in the description where you can grab it you want to make sure it's up to date that way it works with your phone there used to be tricks that way you don't have to wait those tricks don't work anymore don't listen to any of those videos this is the only way to unlock these phones. So you want that latest version of that software. Obviously a Xiaomi phone. You need a Mi account. I'll link down below where you can do that. You need to apply for a bootloader unlock, which is very simple. You just click a button, boom, it goes. You don't have to write no letters anymore, nothing crazy. All right, so let's get into this. I don't want to make it too long. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to open the Mi Flash Unlock software. It's, it's point and click, you know, the drivers are all in here, the, it does it all, you don't have to do anything, in short. Everything is there, you're going to get a disclaimer on the screen, blah, 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 you know, I'm not going to read any of it, because I don't care. It's going to access my account. You guys all know my email address, I really don't care about showing that off. It's in every one of my videos, the password will not show on screen so no need to blur thankfully and then you're going to sign in it's going to blah 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 it's going to check for some crap going to show you your me number now this is where we're going to get the magic going all right so now you want to unlock your phone go down in the corner however you get to your settings Personally, I just search for it. You want to go to, right, you want to make sure you're signed into your me account. As I said, I don't care, really care about showing, it's a little blurry anyway. I want to make sure the monitor stays in, and then you want to go additional, you want to apply, you know, put that in there. Then you want to go with additional settings, developer options. You want to make sure OEM unlocking is on. For some reason, it always turns off. The me unlock status right here. That's what you would want to click on when you first get the phone to make sure your phone is set because it's going to send the serial number and stuff back to their servers and then the countdown is going to begin basically. That's how, that's how I'm told it works anyway. Now at this point we want to get it into fast boot mode. So you want to hold down the volume down, power buttons, let that kind of do a screenshot, it's normal. Phone's going to go into its bloody bloody bloop mode. Bingo bango, we got fast boot. All right, that part was easy, right? Next, USB type C cable right here. Fast boot mode phone, plug in. That's it. Then you're gonna see popped up on the screen what you do, phone connected, me phone. Unlock will erase data. Now, that's what anything you know, just the way it works with any other unlock. It's going to ask you a bunch of questions. You know, it's going to erase, buddy, buddy, blah. You know, they don't want, they don't want you to, yeah, they, they, they don't want you to blame Xiaomi for erasing your phone or whatever, you know. Unlock anyway. Now, this is where it's always failed for me. I'm hoping now it's not going to fail. Unlocking, unlocking. And... I think success, because the phone will go, yay! It's been two full weeks, and now I'm unlocked. It's simple as that. Cool, finally. And that's it. Let's see if I can get this up there. See down below, the phone says, unlocked. Finally, bootloader unlocked, baby. All right, so it was as simple as that. You basically just have to wait your 14 days. Pop that at bad boy in. Now there is a Linux version and a, a Linux 
OSX version of this. It's not official. I've heard it works. Um, it's closed source. You can't see what it's doing. Honestly, I wouldn't recommend it with a Chinese device because if you do brick it and you do hurt it, the warranty is going to be weird. You have to send it to China or maybe they won't even warranty it. Who knows? Stick with the official method that I'm showing you and you'll have good a good turnaround just like I did. Alrighty, guys. I really hope you like this video. It literally took me two weeks in the making, just playing around, trying to get this to work. Finally worked. Please leave me a thumbs up. Comment down below if you got any tricks or you heard anything about how to do this, the best ROMs. I'm going to be looking around to see what I can flash. I hate MIUI. I don't know about you guys. But I'm going to try to get something better on here. All right, guys. See you in the next one. Laters. Peace.